We're at the Science and Industry Museum to look at the history of uh, mills in Manchester because this was the place. and it yes. spins down to the thread. So they've got some pre-spinning to make the rosary. Yeah, well, you put it through cones. Yeah. That I know. Look at them. Isn't that crazy? And it's all wooden. Nice. We're in a mill at the museum. Yeah. So this breaks it up. Uh, you pass it through it about three times. It's still chaotic, but a lot of the dirt and the muck has fallen out with that, this violent yeah. attack. Yeah. And there's more teeth at the top. It's quite, again, it's quite violent. Um, and it's all about taming and controlling the fibre. And then it comes out here, and there'll be a couple of people on each side sort of patting it down, making sure there's no gaps in it. And then it goes through these very hard crushing rollers. Can you see the metal ones? Yeah. There? So they really loosen it up and now they're going to compact it yeah, again. Now they're, they're trying to control it, break its spirit a bit. Okay. And then this, this in here was a, a big fan, a blade that went round and round. Up, round, up, round. This has got a modern dust extractor on, but they wouldn't have done. It would have just hit the floor. Yeah. It just it hit your lungs. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and then uh, it comes out here. Now look at it now. It's starting to look a bit more useful now. Yeah. It's still a mess. There's still bits in it. But it, it then go. you put a big spike through it. You can lift it off there, there. Oh, I was wondering what that... So is that to set it on before you move it to the next? Yeah. It goes to this now. Yeah. This is, this is a carding machine, mm. which is incredibly fine. This is a beautiful machine. It's like a Rolls Royce. It's absolutely yeah. stunningly engineered. And it, um, it takes the last bit out. <laughs> it's like the, he just it? watched me hand pick a pile of wool in my living room over a newspaper. Well, took it in there then. Took me all day. <laughs> all day. Oh, for patience. three skeins of yarn. <laughs> did you, uh, did, and I broke out in hives. <laughs> did, you ever, did you ever have knits over there? Yeah, oh yeah, we have. Yeah, yeah we have. Well, I call this the knit nurse. Oh, this it gets the last bit out. Incredibly fine. Yeah. If you look at these, look. look. Yeah. Oh yeah, How yeah. Fine it is. Yeah, yeah. Right, and this picks out just about the last yeah, bit. It's a bit finer than the other. So if you look. What, oh yeah, then my carter, it's, like it's spider. That, yeah. Look, it's still full of bits. Yeah. Bits of seed, seed cases. It's yeah. still, uh, and also it's fairly chaotic. Yeah. But if it, it goes through this incredible combing machine, and when it comes out here... I assume multiple wheels oh, of that, quite, yeah, quite like, in there. Yeah. yeah, I think there's four or five yeah, or six. There are. Yeah. But look at it now, it's like a beautiful spider's web. A gossamer spider's, spider's web, yeah. But if you blow on it, it's no strength, you blow a hole in it. Oh, okay. And then it gradually comes out here. Uh, it comes out here. And, and they roll spir it, it, I assume. It spirals into these drums. Yeah. And then it goes through a drawer front and, and these spinning machines. And they are spinning it into like a single ply, but yeah. a thick ply. Twelve drumfuls go into one uh, bobbin. Oh, oh, okay. Look, if you look at it now, when it comes off there... Yeah. That's it now. So now, if you compare it to that... Yeah. It's clean. Uh, the fibres are now parallel to one another, more yeah. or less. And... But it's got no strength whatsoever. No. So that machine over there spins it. Okay. And you'll see it working in both of them in about ten minutes. Yeah. Oh no, that's the first one. And then yeah, this is second round. Second. Yeah. But you look at this. If I I just spin it three times. One, two, three. Mm -hmm. That's all. That will now support my weight. Mm. And I've only spun it three times. Three times, yeah. So it's gone from being very pretty but useless. Yeah. So now you've got a thread. 
you yeah. know, and that made Manchester the richest city in, in the, the world, world yeah. for about 30 years. Yeah. Then we gave it all away. <laughs> well, you know. That's what we do. So there's hundreds of different bobbins and spindles depending on what industry it's going to. And different weights. Yeah. Yeah. And it gets spun finer and finer. Finer and finer. And in the end, it can go on a loom, and that, that would go in the pern, you know. The oh, and the, now I remember what that's, that's for. A, that's to that's make a, the the reel is loom. to turn it into the. Um, yeah. Then it makes it into cloth. You know, yeah, cloth. yeah. Walking out of the science museum, it is a kids themed museum, but if you come to Manchester and you're a grown up who loves fiber, go. It doesn't matter. They may not pitch, well, go look for a volunteer, look up the volunteer actually who talked to us. Go look for him. He'll talk you through it in grown up terms. Don't wait. Sit and watch them run the machines, but it's really kid level, the person down below. So there's a guy up on the side who knows way more than the guy down below. Well, the guy down below knows a hell of a lot, but the person talking pitches it to child labor and talks to the kids. So go to bottom line, go to the Museum of Science. Freaking awesome. It is now my favorite museum ever.